Hello everyone, I'm Pacific the Casual Gamer and welcome back to another video. Now in this video, we're going to be talking about a new build for those of you who want to play as a Khajiit. Now if you're a noob to this game, the races can be intimidating because they don't explain all the benefits you get from the races. In fact, there's the attributes and skill system which they do a horrible job of explaining. So let's get into it. For the Khajiit, it's going to be extremely similar to the Argonian. If you've watched that one, it's basically an Argonian that punches. So with a Khajiit, you're going to pick the Thief as your sign, and you're also going to pick a Stealth Specialization. And then for your... Oh, oh God, the cord's everywhere. For your two attributes, you're going to do Speed and Endurance. Okay. Now, when you're using a Khajiit, it's very important that you sneak around, because Khajiits are meant to be stealth characters. And this goes into the skills that I give to you. So for, normally you have seven major skills in a build, I'm gonna only do four for this one, because I feel like the other three, I would like you to experiment with things that you want to experiment with, like maybe bows or magic, anything like that. So for the four skills that I'm picking for this one, it's gonna be hand-to-hand, -hand, sneak, light armor, and illusion. So here's what you do. Illusion, just like the Argonian build, has three important spells. Paralyze, Silence, and Invisibility. Invisibility to help you sneak, Silence so mages can't cast magic, and Paralyze to stop running targets from their impending doom. Now instead of a Khajiit, or instead of an Argonian using a sword, a Khajiit's gonna do punches. This is kind of weird. So punching in this game, as much as it seems like it's underpowered, you can still use it. It's still a very viable thing. In fact, I have a Khajiit character that does punching, swords, and bow, and they're all about, they're all effective, especially because he's a vampire, and I have like a 40 plus on hand to hand. It balances out, and his punching is just as good as his swords and bows. So, you know, if you want to, swapping hand to hand to a sword or a mace or a bow isn't going to change the build at all. It's just hand to hand. If you want to learn it, Khajiit is the easiest class to learn hand-to-hand -hand on. So all you're going to do, really, is sneak around and kill people. That's what you do as a Khajiit. So you sneak around and kill people. Um, it, there's nothing more to say. Some kind of skills that can help you if you want some other guide for your major skills <clears throat> is Restoration to fortify your sneak. Destruction or Marksman so that you have some sort of ranged combat. And... Alchemy. The alchemy is a weird one. Alchemy is so that you can make potions to help you. Such as chameleon potions, which is kind of like invisibility, but you can... Invisibility, it goes off as soon as you do something. Chameleon, it doesn't. Um, alchemy, you know, you got some resist damage potions. So if you do get in a rut, you're, I mean, you can't really one-shot people with melee at all, it seems, or archery sneaks. So you're gonna be made in, you're gonna get, end up in combat. So if you have a higher alchemy skill with more kind of effects on ingredients available, you're gonna be able to make stronger potions. But that's really it for this build, guys. I hope you enjoyed. If you have any questions, feel free to ask them in the comments below. I'm Pacific the Casual Gamer. I suck just as bad as you do at video games, and I will see you in the next episode, stream vlog, or steam it post. Of whatever I decide to make.